Now we're building Zhao. Now, I don't like Zhao. He's obviously a very, very good character. My best friend, uh, Connor, plays a lot of Zhao. And he might even moan at me for this build. Because um, I don't play Vermilion Hereafter. I occasionally play Zhao. And obviously, Vermilion Hereafter is great. Once again, I hate farming. Um, if you've got Vermilion Hereafter, it's very good on him. I like to play the old school two piece bruiser set, which is two piece of any attack percentage bonus, two piece anime damage. Um, so, Viridescent Gladiators or uh, Viridescent and, well, any other attack plus 18% set. Uh, Primordial Jade Spear is best in the slot. Staff of Homar um, is obviously also incredible. The Deathmatch or Blackcliff Owl, I can't really think of any free to play weapons that are incredible on him. Um, Obviously, Blackcliff Pole is a free-to-play weapon if you save up enough um, Star Glitter or Stardust. Um, if you're a Zhao main and you don't want to wish on his weapon banner at any point, um, and you don't have a spare Primordial Jade, spare, well, not spare. If you don't have a Primordial Jade, spare Staff of Homer um, or Deathmatch, I suggest saving your uh, Star Glitter or Stardust. I believe it's Star Glitter. Um, unfortunately, Primordial Jade wasn't released when we had the crit rates at 44 and the crit damage is at 88 so it is quite difficult to get his crit rate and crit damage as high as you want um i suggest focusing on crit rate and crit damage anime damage bonus and attack percentage once again if you want a million hereafter um go go farm it like it, it's very it's a different build it's a completely different build same as uh ganyu has like melt and reverse melt this version of Zhao you can play on any team. The Vermilion Hereafter is like a very, he is the DPS, all the other people help him, um, which is why I prefer this build. Um, but yeah, he's a very good DPS. Uh, he's a very good sub DPS as well. If you just want to flick to him, use his ult and bounce around the map for a minute. Um, if you've got Pogo Man and you've got a good enough weapon, play the shit out of him. Um, I might play him some more in future. I might. Play him as soon as his Primordial Jade Wing Sphere is R5. We might have to run around with him properly at that point. But for now, we're moving on to Hutan, my uh, massively preferred polearm user. 